Japan's high-speed trains, the Shinkansen, can reach speeds of up to 320 kilometers an hour. They connect the country's largest cities. Japan has much to offer in terms of modern infrastructure. But for the Olympic Games in 2020, Tokyo is investing even more in cutting-edge technology. Participants are discussing future visions and impulses in the athletic world here at the World Forum on Sport and Culture. It's being hosted by the Japanese government and the World Economic Forum in Geneva. I think the role of Tokyo in 2020 is to show and demonstrate what technology can play so that other cities can learn from the same lesson. It could be a failure, it could be a successful case. Both will be a big, big uh, uh, resource for other cities in the future. What role do sports play in the city today, and how will it look in the future? These are questions asked during a lively debate sponsored by Deutsche Welle and the World Economic Forum in Tokyo. When employers invest in the, an, an active workforce, they see huge benefits as it relates to reduction in cost of um, healthcare premiums. Uh, they'll see much more innovation, much more productivity. Basically, their work workforce will be uh, working for them much more productively. But the electronic games that are so loved in Japan don't count as sufficient physical activity. Even if there are whole neighborhoods in Tokyo where young people are dedicated to nothing else.